What's up, my love Lord Jack Larons, and welcome back to Soma episode 10. We finally hit double digits in the series. Hell yeah. So we just got done dealing with a fuckface McGee, Mr. Terry Akers over there. And we were able to get the system up and running. But now we have to go back to um uh to Catherine's little lab and go on the computers and find a security cipher or someone who has it so we can get the done bat out of uh, quarantine. So, yeah, which I'm assuming it's in there. Um, and I'm hurt, which really is annoying. I don't know how you're supposed to heal, to be honest. My vision's all weird and blurry, so it's kind of tripping me out, but it's okay. Yeah, I ain't ever opening that door again. All right, Catherine. Let's go. Let's get the security cipher. Come on, guys. So, yeah, last time we went down that corridor and dealt with a terrible creature... And uh, now we are uh, heading to her lab again. Oh my God, I'm like limping. I am, my leg is broken, Catherine. You put me through so much shit. It is awful. But, uh, but yeah, basically we went through some shit last episode and it was terrifying. So now we are uh, heading to the low. scanner me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathwork already etched into the base. So if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent the whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Huh. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them roam free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Yeah, that would be fucked up. Used to work like that. Truly sentient machines thinking they are people is definitely new. Yeah. Sentient for the arc. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Dude, that's so crazy. So she basically just made robot sentient, which is transferring people's consciousness into the robot machinery. Wow, dude. Yeah, see, these computers are open now. Okay, this is kind of bothering me. This is the only thing I don't like about the game. Is like, you don't heal. Like, when you hurt, when you're hurting, you don't, like, your vision doesn't clear up. And I think that's kind of frustrating. But it's okay. We'll deal with it. Scan log. Uh, Catherine Chun, July 4th. Nikolai... Arc project on hold as Shomer investigates the death of Serang. Yeah, because he killed himself, remember? He poisoned himself. Shomer reprimanded me one more death and went out. Suicide. Oh my god, look. All these people commit suicide. Nathan, Gavin, Astrid. Everyone's killing themselves. Guy, suicide. Arc project on hold indefinitely. So eventually John Stromar put a stop to it because he's like, stop, you're making people kill themselves, stop. Dude. Uh, okay, um, let's check this one out. Scan project active, insert ship containing scan data. What? What chip? Is that where we need the security cipher? Is this where this comes in? Oh! Oh, fuck. They're all fried? Are you shitting my ass? Please! Oh! Oh! Wait! Wait, give it up! Okay, but where do I inject it? That's the thing. Uh, here? Yes! Yes! Ah, oh, we're doing it! Okay. Sarah Linwall, batch four compressed newograph 
tenuous time, three minutes, July 7th, captured, death unknown, upload. Interesting. No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Okay, Theta Security Group. Mark was from, subject Mark Serang, killed himself because of the continuity of Stromar, is really mad his Titan Security Arc project is on hold. Peter Shrasky, right? Death is unknown. Birth, March 11th, 2068. Dude, he was born in 2068. So it's gotta be like 2050 something. That one won't work either. Look for security people at Kronstadt or Stromar. Okay, scroll now. Okay. This is kind of just like a, a, a pick and choose kind of thing. No, I don't think so. Stromar recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher if you can find one of them. Okay, well, I'm trying. Brandon, maybe? <laughs> oh, shit, sorry. <laughs> Very promising. Oh. I'll just load them up and get the simulator going. Sweet. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. What? Environment none. Environment module none. Located Brandon Wayne. Are we like gonna load his brain up and talk to him? Stress. So are these literally like, it's like a backup feed. Their consciousness brain waves are on a, on a chip that we just inserted and it's backed up. They back it up and then they can load them like a fucking machine. That's crazy. Let's try again. Let's see if he's more compliant. Okay, come on. He's going to freak out again. Mr. Wan. Chuck? What happened to me? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that, that's a lie. No. You're lying. Mr. Wan, I need you to stay calm. No, no, no. no. Why, are you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, John. I trusted you. Dude. Okay, what do we need? Well, Catherine, what should I work with? What should I do? I don't know what to do, Catherine. What do you want me to do, Catherine? None. I can't click on anything. Okay, uh... Okay. Uh, simulation assets. Okay. How do I, oh. Sweet, we could change the environment. 
Beach. Let's do beach. Whoa. Yes. Mr. Vaughn, I need your help. Dr. Chad, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Everything's fine. Thaden needs your help. We need the new security cipher. Dr. Chad? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here. It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this. Oh my god. The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Ski Lodge? Let's try Ski Lodge. What the f I need a favor. I need to know what the new security cipher is. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. Please, we really need that cipher. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Charlie. I'll punch your teeth in. Jesus Christ. I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. Okay, well, you know, maybe if I, damn it, ah, I'm frustrated. What, what data do we need? I don't understand, Catherine. Brandon Wang, Brandon Wang, Brandon Wang, right? Here we go, Brandon Wang's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Yes. Okay, good, I'm thinking straight, I'm good. I'm not going crazy. All right, let's, so we basically need to build get to know him maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother yeah damn that was frustrating because i was like why is this not working but it, it seems like to me maybe we got to build like a, a environment for him to be comfortable in is that his wife cute yeah. oh it's his grand it's his parents oh Okay. August 14th. Akers finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Goya, Cryer, and I moved into Theta today. Akers said he'd stick around for a while longer. That crazy bastard. I take pride in my work, but goddamn, that place is miserable since the service stopped sending parts. Huh. August 25th. Is this, yeah, this is Brandon Shun. I mean, Brand, sorry, Brandon Wan. They did their scans together. Alice Coster? We could try to make him think that she's there during the simulation. Yeah. Might make him talk. Not sure how, though. Keep looking. Yeah, we could maybe do that. To make him feel more, like, at ease and comfortable. <clears throat> so maybe they were getting stuff. Maybe Pathos 2 was built before the apocalypse. And they were getting stuff from the surface. And then the apocalypse happened. Did my arc scan together with Alice? Stromar told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. I was fine at first, but not... I got a splitting headache a couple hours later. The biggest pain was that Chun. Was Chungo, she's so fucking uncomfortable at all times, it makes my skin crawl. Ooh, it seems like he did not like Catherine. Shoma went ballistic and shut down all the future scans for the art project. Apparently, Conrad wanted to end on the continuity and just freed himself, fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting a new security side first. Jesus. Just heard that. <clears throat> Crombie survey team is going to Delta to pick up Acres. He's been alone for months now. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Nope, nope. They all die. Acres kills them, and that was Acres down there. Is that his home? I think that's his home, yeah. All right, let's look at this little data thing. Waiting for 
stress can help borrow a pack of this stuff. And downstairs, I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. Damn, I'm short. I think I just heard Alice talking to Brandon on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great, this is exactly what we need. Okay, cool. I really got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. Nice. You trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Yeah. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could date a line. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. Huh. <laughs> Simon's gonna get those robot chicks. <laughs> now let's do beach. Run. <clears throat> that wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up faster. Wow. What the hell happened? Where are we? Behold, the ark. We made it? I didn't realize it would work this way. Just one thing. Oh my god. This dude's impossible. Come on, Simon, don't give up now. Wait, there's another computer. Well, let's do this. In here. Yeah. Sweet. Okay. Uh, environment beach, scan room, copy the chip, yes. Oh, we have other scans, wow. Float tank, beach, Versailles? <laughs> Let's copy that to the chip. Oh, damn it. Okay, maybe if we do this. Maybe we do the scan room. Uh, can I put it in? What is this? Uh, Strasky, come in. Oh, I'm this is new. The, lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Woo! Jesus, how? Um, maser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Stromer. No, please! You can sneak a 300 pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Oh, Catherine. She's just trying to make a project. Oh, I did. Like, I didn't even grab it. <laughs> God, my. Dude, I'm getting pissed. Mr. Fucking Chun's annoying the shit out of me. Brandon one is annoying. Let's try the scan room. Run. <clears throat> that wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up faster. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. Ross Trollar. He said he needed to be a site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Chum just tell you to take these? Oh! It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. Long. Red. Goodbye. No, wait. 
Oh, that's sad. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. Okay. Dude, that was difficult. <laughs> that was like a lot more complex than I thought it would be. Okay. Jesus. Well, we got it. Finally. God, Mr. Wan, stop being a little bitch. And God, it's the fucking security cipher. Now we can get the dumb bat. Thank God. All right. All right. I'm still limping, but it's fine. We're holding in. There you are. Just yeah. warming up the dumb bat for us. Thank you. Oh. Okay, that's it. That's everything. Let's go ahead and huh. That's weird. No. Never mind. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omni tool can open the door now and get into the gun back. Then plug me in and I'll take us into the abyss. Sounds easy enough. Yeah. What is that? Oh, was it the door that led from over there? Wait, what? This one? Oh, I gotta take the Omni tool. Okay. Well, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here because I feel like getting in the Dunbat is going to create a big chain reaction to some things. Damn, that was really crazy. Damn, doing the wand thing. That's really, really sad though. I mean, if you really think about it, like that's pretty messed up. Like really, that's pretty messed. Um, Like putting that, putting Brandon through a situation like that. That's really sad. I really like how a lot of like the characters we've gotten to like know like, we've gotten to kind of figure out, like, the backstory a little bit. Like, Robin and Brandon and, like... We haven't figured out Peter Stratsky, which is really weird. We figured out what happened to Terry Akers and Karabi and all those people at Delta, which is crazy. But, um... God, that that was a little... Fr I'm not gonna lie, that was a little frustrating. I was just kind of like, dude, just give us the security cipher. But it's fine. We did it. We made it. We have the security cipher. So now we can get the Dunbat... We go to the abyss, guys. Then we can go get the Ark. We're coming so close. It's so crazy. I can't believe that we've come this far with just not just for Simon, but also just with Catherine as well. We've come so far. Theta is a really cool part of the game. I really like it. It's a bit more convoluted than I think it needed to be, but it's pretty cool still. So I will see you guys for episode 11. Please leave a like, subscribe to become a Jack Lantern, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.